These are the hands of your best friend, young and strong and full of love for you, that are holding yours on your wedding day as you promise to love each other today, tomorrow and forever. We've been dating nearly 10 years now. Which is a third of my life, <laughs> which is strange. So me and Lillian, we met um, in, in medical school. So it was the first day of medical school and we had like a um, orientation barbecue thing. And um, a mutual friend of ours just introduced us um, and we really hit it off uh, from there. Yeah, we were just basically inseparable. He always makes sure that I have a meal. If I finish work late, I come home and there's something to eat. Even if he's kind of gone out with his friends, he'll make sure that there's a meal there for me. Like one of the things that I really love about her, as soon as she wakes up, she's like chirping, singing a song that she's recently heard on the radio or a thing that like we have like in our relationship, just like singing random snippets of songs. When I decided that I wanted to do anaesthetics, I got on in Tasmania, so I had to move to Launceston for a year. So Austin kind of took a step backwards, even though he was on a training program and came with me to Launceston. Actually, poor thing, he like had to go up a few months before I did to like secure his job. So he was living in this like, uh, <laughs> it was like a concrete box, like prison that didn't even have blinds and it was like 40 degrees and didn't have air con. I was perfectly happy um, to not put our relationship on the line. And I, you know, moved with her to Tasmania for that year as well. I don't know, it's just this like unwavering commitment that I have to her that I always follow and trust. You know, it just hasn't let me down so, even though life has presented to us like hard situations, as long as I follow that, like everything ends up working out. I guess more him, but we've both kind of make, made sacrifices along the way to ensure that we're both together, because for us that's the most important thing. Over these 10 years, we have witnessed their union deepen and blossom. Faced with the unrelenting pressures of work and their ongoing training, their love has shone and strengthened. Together, they have become generous and loving human beings with so much to offer all that is life. I, Austin, take you, Lillian, to be my wife. I, Lillian, take you, Austin, to be my husband. I promise to be true to you in good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. I will love you and honour you all the days of my life. <laughs> Honestly, so many boys have liked Lillian. <laughs> Um, which, like, obviously. Uh, many years later, Lillian has much better taste in boys. She has found a man who is exceptionally kind, compatible and highly worthy of her brilliance. Did you know that contrary to what everyone would think, uh, it was Lillian that did the chasing when we first met? <laughs> she, had, she has good taste. <laughs> I was being pursued endlessly. To Lillian, my best friend, soulmate, I can't imagine life without you. You absolutely fascinate me the way you did when we first met and I wouldn't have it any other way. I'm so glad that we found each other and I can't wait to share life's experiences, make memories, raise a family. You are what I've been waiting my whole life for. I love you Lillian.